Curtains, vintage tea sets and toys, all the things you'd expect to see in a charity shop. All of these items have been donated to help families with seriously ill children here in the northeast. And over the last 10 days, £200 worth is believed to have been stolen. Really, really sad. Um, obviously, the charity was put out there to help other children. So to think that people are coming in and stealing from where it, it, it breaks my heart, really. You know, it, the charity was set up in Charlie's name and now Carter's name. Um, and all we want to do is support other families. So to think that us trying to do some good, then other people are taking that opportunity away from us. The police, they know that they know that it's a problem. You know, South Shields is a small town. You know, we give them the information. They do what they can with it. Um, it's it's hard. It's hard because we pass it on, and then we just hope that something comes of it. The Charlie and Carter Cookson Foundation was set up almost six years ago after Chris and Sarah's first son died at the age of just two. The family went on to face more heartache this winter when Charlie's younger brother Carter was born on Boxing Day and needed a new heart. He died three weeks later. The last time I saw uh, Chris and Sarah, they were in the hospital with Carter still. H how are they getting on now? They're, they're doing what they do, you know, they're, they're amazing people um, that's just thrown themselves back into the charity. They, they want something good to come out of Charlie and Carter's short time with work. Um, they did amazing in Charlie's name and they're now on a mission to do the same again in Carter's name. After all they've gone through, the charity has raised £190,000 and has helped support 62 other families. Joanne says that they're looking for more volunteers to work in the shop in the hopes of dissuading shoplifters. Northumbria Police says they recognise the significance of retail crime and the impacts it can have on shops like this.